Hello, hello, guys. Black Friday finds. Just a little explanation. $850. Don't tell it to my husband. Pretty good deal. 12 a.m. You need to be there. Have a great day. Hello. Hello, hello, guys. One of those days where I just feel so drained. I don't know, like after pregnancy, I have those days where I like so extremely tired. I'd never had that before. I don't know if I should check my hormones or something because some days I'm just like, I barely can stand up from bed. Anyway, cleaning up all the mess after Art Basel. It's been here for a good week. My husband is like already, maybe it's about time to put things in places and decide to film a little vlog for you guys with my Black Friday finds i honestly didn't really shop this year as much as i used to for black friday just because i don't know why i was like not feeling it and i got only a few things that i actually liked some things i'm gonna return so let's just since i'm cleaning up i'll take you along this little vlog let's go guys let's do this also, before we start, I want to show you this beautiful red roses that we have right there. My husband doesn't love red roses in the house for whatever reason. To me, the red roses represent love and passion and I just love to have that in the house. He likes more of a neutral kind of object. Doesn't love the pop of colors in the interior design, but since it's Christmas, it was a perfect excuse for me to convince him that the red roses should be in our house. Yes, baby. Anyway, today vlog is not about the roses, it's about Black Friday, so let's just get back to it. Black Friday finds. Okay, guys, so Black Friday, for those who doesn't know, maybe because you don't live in US, I feel like when I came to USA, I didn't know what Black Friday is. So just a little explanation what Black Friday is. Black Friday is big biggest sale in America of the year where everything pretty much goes on sale and you have to be kind of quick to get it to get the right stuff because at first year when I decide to do it I like end up not getting anything because my sizes were gone so I think it's really important to just go like a week before do your research and things that you like put all the links in the spreadsheet and then just as soon as things go on sale that day you go like a minute minute things go on sale like at 12 a.m. you need to be there you just just click on all the links and you see which things got on sale and hopefully you'll be lucky enough to get it anyway this year I wouldn't say I got a lot of stuff but I got some so I wanted to show you what I got because actually a few people asked me in the comment to feature the items in the video so I just decided to do a separate vlog on it so let's start with workout stuff I feel like it's never enough of workout stuff especially when you live in Miami I work out a lot I feel like in Miami you wear two things comfortable dresses like linen dresses and and workout stuff that's my like most used items that I wear in Miami so I could not miss a sale in Alo uh, I've got a bunch of stuff there I actually got a lot of stuff for my husband there was like a major sale look at the shorts that I got it's like a tight shorts on the bottom and then loose shorts on top I think it's it's like sporty but still sexy and it's matching top as well with this love the gray color I think I actually don't have any workout stuff that is gray so that was a perfect buy because I wanted to have something gray and also there is a top you can actually wear it together because sometimes if I go from like workout to a playground with Allegra I'm not always changing and I feel a little odd to like come in a workout bra to a playground where kids are and, and moms and, and dads are so just to throw this on top will be a perfect perfect thing for this kind of occasions one more thing I got oof next thing so Zimmerman I feel like Zimmerman is a brand that definitely very Miami because it's happy colors it's prints it's good materials good natural materials that is breathable for like a hot weather got the shorts I actually it's funny I tried the shorts on when they just came out and I was like mm not sure maybe and then I end up not getting them and then I was just going through a website I think it was Neta Porter and I saw them on sale so I was like okay I'm gonna get them it's time I believe they were let me see how much they were I want to show you how much money I saved so let's see 
found it took me like a good 10 minutes to find actually it was not from net Apporter. it was from fashion forward by alice walker i love to shop on this website because it's so easy to return because they already print the returning label all you have to do is just put the sticker on top of the box and check mark things that you want to return and that's it i don't understand why all the website cannot do the same like why you have to print yourself and press so many buttons and do so many actions to make a return like that's why i love to shop on this website actually because it's so easy to return anyway i got the shirts there the original price was 425 dollars i got it for 280 dollars so that's pretty good i can wear them like during summertime i mean we have summer all year around but i would imagine it was like a tight beige top or white top or even linen like blouse would be good too so i think this is good item good purchase good price i feel like lately i'm, I'm buying less dresses more like rompers and shorts just because i realized that with allegra it's easier for me to have shorts rather than skirts okay next one this one was also a good purchase because original price was 2600 i bought it for $1,600, so it was a big discount but i love it but i realize i have very very similar item from max mara let me just show you it's like a jacket like that i think it's very nice and, and beautiful i can you can even like wear it with high boots could be a really cool look you know more like a jacket dress kind of jacket coat <laughs> dress coat but i don't know i'm still thinking if i should return it because i actually have the same exact material the same exact color coat that is a little bit longer but the same style you know what i mean like i love it but i feel like it's too similar what do you guys think need your help so let's just see oh so yeah it's from balmain and it has beautiful buttons like that here and also on the sleeve i feel like it has also buttons so the details are really nice and the coat is beautiful but i'm still debating if i should keep it or return it but i should hurry up because the returning time is is close to i, I i'm running out of time basically okay next item from the same website fashion forward is stella mccartney jacket like a sporty jacket it has like a pocket in front and kind of a high neck love the color because i have a lot of like neutral kind of colors of my workout clothes i feel like this will go well with a lot of my outfits always love stella mccartney adidas line very overpriced so that's why i'm always waiting for it to go on sale it's actually was also coming with like a pants but they didn't have my size so that's the reason why i bought just the jacket but i think i could still rock the jacket separately so original price was $850. $850 for a sport jacket? No, thank you. So I bought it for $340. Still freaking expensive, but honestly, I have another jacket from Stella McCartney that I had for seven years, and I'm not kidding. I've been wearing it so much. It's like already have a holes on it. So I'm like, you know what? Since I've been using this jacket so much and I love it so much, I'll give it a shot to the next one. It was about time to get the next one. So I feel like a good purchase. Don't tell it to my husband that I bought a jacket for almost $400 a sport jacket. He will not think it was a good purchase. Okay, okay, to wrap up the video, last item of the Black Friday sale, shoes. I could not skip the buying shoes. You know, guys, I'm a shoes addict, <laughs> love shoes. Okay, so these ones are very much out of my comfort zone. I'm always a person that buys neutral shoes and bags because I feel like I have a lot of dresses and, and skirts that are printed like they have prints and colors. So I feel like I need neutral things to, you know, to match it with. So the shoes without discount, I would never buy it. But since it wasn't a discount, I was like, hmm, I'll give it a shot. It's Amina Moadi shoes that goes like really high, tie up really high to the knee. Amina Moadi signature heel. It's silver. I actually don't have silver shoes. Like that's probably my first silver shoes I own. And it has a lot of like rainbow stones, which is, which is so not me. <laughs> 
but I already wore them two times since I got them and I got them like two weeks ago I received the package two weeks ago so I'm like yes it was a good purchase I wore it for one of the Art Basel events with like a black dress and got a lot of compliments for it so the one thing that I will be interested to see is if these stones will fall off or not because very often on those kind of shoes the stones don't stay too long so we'll see let me show you the price so the original price for those shoes was 1510 I got it for $1,057 so it was $500 discount almost pretty good deal and it was expensive for shoes like 1500 for shoes is expensive thousand maybe still expensive but love them I already wore them so that was pretty much it so I think I'll keep everything except the coat maybe I think I will return the coat just I feel like I will not use it as much if this coat if this coat would be a cream color I definitely would keep it because I feel like I need something more like a cream color coat or jacket I don't know just have to look more for it anyway that was my purchase I also got a lot of cosmetic like I always kept forgetting how many sales happening on cosmetic and like it's kind of adds up even so I focus more on like buying more expensive stuff that I feel kind of greedy to buy for the regular prices but like cosmetic sets up in the end and I bought a lot of like Armani foundation which I use all the time Tom Ford eyeshadow cream eyeshadows which was also on sale so like keep in mind also the cosmetic part anyway guys that's the end of the video I'm gonna go and clean up my favorite stuff my favorite thing to do yeah my favorite thing to do anyway guys have a great day love you see you in the next video don't forget to like this video please and you can find all the links below. I, I will link everything. I hope that it's still available, the stuff that I showed you. Bye!